Well, in light of all the gun violence we've seen lately, there's a very important event coming up this weekend. Guns to Gardens Safe Surrender is this Saturday. Very happy to have Rita Black from Most Precious Blood Catholic Church in Denver with us here where this event is going to be held this weekend. Rita, thank you so much for being with us today. Thank you for inviting me to come. Thank you so much. Yeah, we just are so excited about this. Um, as she was talking about a few seconds ago, we were so excited to have her here. Tell us a little bit about this unique program that you guys are offering. So Guns to Gardens Metro Denver is a group that's associated with the National Guns to Gardens movement. So a lot of us have been trained through that movement and we um, um, are interested in reducing gun violence here in our city and we're doing that by dismantling guns and turning them into garden tools and we do that with the help of Mike Martin from Raw Tools. So what incentives do you offer people to come in to surrender their weapons? Well first of all grocery cards. So if you bring in a weapon, we'll give you either a 50 or 150 or $250 oh, wow. yeah. grocery card for, and thanks for bringing in your weapon. But of course, the greater incentive is to make your house safe. That is an incentive in itself that people with unsecured weapons um, will not have to have this in their house. They, they won't have unwanted weapons. We'll take care of them for them. You were talking to a little bit, Rita, about the changes that happens when people and the way that they feel when they actually hand over their or they surrender their weapons. Talk a little bit about that. Yeah, so we know that people come for different reasons. We have people who come because they've inherited a gun and they don't really know what to do with it. So they're glad to get it out of their house. That's a relief. Mm -hmm. But we also have people who surrender weapons that have um, been used for, sadly, a suicide and it's been turned back to them by the police and they are happy to watch it being cut into pieces. And then tell us a little bit about the tools and how you're, you're taking something, um, you know, like a weapon and turning it into something that gardens and reaps the soil. Tell us a little bit about that. And you have a couple of the tools I, right here. I do. So Mike Martin is a blacksmith at, and, and he takes these mm -hmm. gun parts mm -hmm. and turns them into things that give life. So this little hatchet is made from a semi-automatic gun barrel. Mm -hmm. It's beautiful. Yeah. <laughs> By the yeah. way, it's absolutely beautiful. Yeah. It's yeah. It, yeah. So so yeah. well tooled. And this one is made from a semi-automatic rifle, and um, it's about five inches of the gun barrel. So um, this one is made from a shotgun barrel, and it's a heart. And the the um, theme of Mike Martin's um, ministry is. Um, disarm hearts and um, forge peace. Mm -hmm. So we have these all available through his website, but also they're gonna be sold at Denver Urban Gardens, which is partnering oh, with us great. as well. Well, Rita, thank you so much for being with us. We're gonna have much more um, information about the event that's coming up on our website. So that's where everybody can find all that information. It's a Saturday from 10 in the morning until noon at the Most Precious Blood Catholic Church. That's Colorado Boulevard and Iliff. Michael.